everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to do a tag video for you guys. So this tag is the this or that equestrian tag. And um, I kind of guess I can take credit for this tag as I came up with these questions myself. I think I've only seen one other person do the equestrian tag this or that tag um, on YouTube, but she had different questions. A couple of them were the same, but this one I came up with most of the questions by myself, so I'm just going to take credit for it. And this or, this or that tag, how it works is I'm going to say like two different options that are equestrian related, two different things, and then I say which one I prefer. I'm terrible at explaining things, I apologize, um, but I'm sure you'll start to understand what I am doing and talking about um, once I start the tag. Um, and I'm just going to be reading off the tag questions from my phone, so if I'm looking down, that is why. Anyways, let's get started. So the first one is short or long manes, and I definitely prefer short manes, um, paddock boots and half chaps or field boots. I definitely prefer field boots because I find that they provide a lot more support for my leg when I'm riding. I don't know if that's just me, but I just, I just prefer them and they're also way easier to put on. The next one is grays or bays. I would say grays. I love grays. Um, even though they get dirty really easily, I am a sucker for a gray. Horses or ponies? Definitely horses. Greenies or trained horses? Um, probably trained horses. Brown or black tack? Definitely brown, but for dressage, I think black is classy and I would stick to black for dressage. Hunters or jumpers? Well, I've only tried hunters, so I'm gonna say hunters. Um, but hopefully in the future with Midas, I will try jumpers. And I also prefer to watch jumpers. I think it's much more exciting than watching the hunters. English or Western? Definitely English, but I would love to try Western and Western disciplines, especially barrel racing. I think that would be really, really fun. Ogilvy or Eco Gold? Well, I've only tried Ogilvy, so I can't really give much of an opinion about Eco Gold. Um, I love my Ogilvy saddle pads. Um, I have an Ogilvy half pad and I'm not against them, um, but I'm not sure that they benefit every horse and I'm not sure every horse needs one. Um, I definitely got my half pad on a whim. Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, but I, I mean, I, I think Ogilvy, Ogilvy makes beautiful pads. I, like I said, I love their saddle pads, like, they come in so many colors, and, yeah, but I would love to try Eco Gold, and I would love to try their pad, for sure. Full seats or knee patch breeches? Definitely knee patch breeches. I don't think I've ever worn full seat breeches, but I just prefer the look of knee patch breeches. Greenhawk or Dover? Well, I'm Canadian, so definitely Greenhawk. I've never been to Dover, um, but if I was ever in the States, I'd love to go to a Dover just to check it out. Showing or no showing? Um, I like to show. I enjoy it a lot. Um, so showing, but I mean, I'm just as happy to ride at home or go on trail ride. Stud muffins or lickets? Definitely stud muffins. I think my horse much prefers stud muffins to lickets. Uh, SSG or Rokel? I prefer Rokel gloves. I've never tried SSG gloves. They look like nice gloves and I'd be totally open to trying them. I just am absolutely obsessed with my Rokel gloves. They're beautiful gloves and they're super comfy and I love them. An all-purpose saddle or a dressage saddle? Definitely an all-purpose saddle for me because I don't ride dressage all the time. Flat work or jumping? I can appreciate flat work and how much it benefits the horse and how important it is, but jumping is my thing. It's what I really enjoy and it's what I have fun doing, so definitely jumping. Cowboy magic or mane and tail? Probably mane and tail just because it smells so good and... 
I've used more mane and tail products than Cowboy Magic, I think. Liver Chestnut or Chestnut? Probably Liver Chestnut. Mare's Geldings or Stallions? Definitely Geldings for me. Um, I don't have much experience around Stallions because we don't have any at my barn. We don't really board Stallions. We have before, but um, we try and keep it to Mare's and Geldings. Um, yeah, I'm not really a mare person. <laughs> helmet or no helmet? Mind your melon and wear your helmet. Bridalus or bareback? Uh, probably bareback. Um, it may sound pathetic, but... Oh, wait, no. I was gonna say, I've never ridden bridalus before, but I have ridden in a halter, but... Like, I've never ridden with nothing on the horse's face, so... I should try that sometime. Fun colors or neutrals? I'm definitely a neutral person. I like my neutrals. Neutrals go with everything. Neutrals are just my thing, but you know what? I really do like to have fun. <laughs> wow, I sound like such a boring person. I like to have fun and dress my horse up in colorful colors sometimes. And I do have some more colorful pads and um, colorful like polo shirts for myself and you know, Sometimes it's just fun to match and wear like bright colors. Boots or polo wraps? Probably boots because they're easier to just throw on, they don't take as much time to put on, and you don't have to roll them up like polo wraps. CWD or Antares? Um, I haven't really used many Antares products. I don't even know if I've ridden in an Antares saddle. Um, I have ridden in a CW or a few CWD saddles and they're super comfy and I really like them. Mind you, I have not heard great things about their customer service, but both products or both brands make absolutely gorgeous products that I would love to buy. Um, mind you, they are very expensive. Um, I'm just going to say CWD though because I have much more experience or not even that much experience but more experience with their products compared to Antares. Trot or canter? Probably canter. My horse has a pretty comfortable canter. Slow or fast horses? This one's hard. I'm kind of like... I'm like... I, I'm fine with either. Um, my horse is definitely slower. He is a warm blood and... Um, he took a lot to get used to when I first uh, tried him out and had him on trial. Um, just because I was used to faster horses. Um, I don't know. I I'm fine with either, so I can't. I don't. I don't know. I can't really say like one or the other. I'm just gonna say either. <laughs> Okro or sock bottoms on your breeches. There seems to be a big hoo-ha about this because I don't see people do breeches reviews or breeches collections on YouTube and some people will be fine with velcro bottoms and some people will be like I love my sock bottoms like hating on the velcro bottoms like oh my god like stay away from velcro bottoms like they just get so worked up about it and you know what I don't know if I really care like Sometimes I don't like Velcro bottoms because they will catch on other clothing and like make the pil clothing pill. Um, so I'm just like really dil diligent about closing the Velcro bottoms when I'm not using the breeches or when I'm putting them in the wash. Um, and I do like sock bottoms because they can be easy to just pull your breech on, but some sock bottoms are really tight around the ankle part and it makes it really hard to get your breeches on and off, which like really drives me nuts so I don't know I'm almost leaning towards velcro bottoms but it's not like a huge deal for me so I'll just say velcro and the last question is gloves or no gloves okay I hate riding without gloves I hate it so definitely gloves like I just feel like I can't ride as well without gloves and like I just it's not comfortable to me so definitely, I'm always riding in gloves. Okay, so because this is a tag video, I do want to tag a few people specifically. Um, and those people would be Montana O, Toon Tailored, 
belong to Bill, Kate G. B., Exceptional Equine and Horse Federation. Also, um, just because I specifically tagged a few people does not mean you can't do this tag, so feel free to do this tag. Um, if you do do this tag as a video, send me or link me the link to your video below in the comments so I can go watch it. I would love to see it. Um, yeah, so I think that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, probably wasn't very exciting, but I felt like doing a tag video anyways. So that's that, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!